Last night, very late, we arrived to the city of Kulluftar and this is the center where all the volunteer forces of Basij and Sefa are being coordinated to go to help the people who are being affected by flood. And they are you know, becoming ready to be dispatched from this center to different parts which is affected by the flood. I am just at the heart of the city of Kulluftar. You may see what is the condition. Blood has gone, but the mud is everywhere. Here are the volunteer forces cleaning one by one the magnitude and the level of the damage is really high. As you know, there was a fundraising in Kashmir for flood affected people of Iran and I am supposed to make a survey also where we can use these funds. I was just here talking to the person from IRGC who is in charge of this area trying to clean it and I was asking what is the urgent need of people. He said that the most urgent uh, important issue in the city of Kulluftar is to take this mud, this blood, this water out of the city. Lorestan is one of the most beautiful provinces of Iran. Just look behind me. Lorestan uh, had never faced the shortage of water. Uh, this morning we left the city of Kuldoftar towards the city of Kudasht. So we reached to a place and there is an old bridge, Kashkan bridge, it is some 1,000 years old. Of course, this was destroyed not because of the flood, but because of the passage of time. Uh, but there was another bridge being used by people, which is this bridge, which is totally destroyed by the flood. Ma'mulan is a city which is highly destroyed by flood, and there is no access to this city. We found a road by which we were trying to reach to the city of Ma'mulan, but when we reached to this village, which is a village named as Hayatul Ghayr, which is exactly next to the river, we got to know that the bridge is totally washed and totally destroyed and there is nothing as a bridge over there. So there is no other possibility of going forward and reach to the Mamulan city.